Hey. Hey. Hmm. My parents make me so mad sometimes. Just like the time they couldn't decide who gets a dog, so they just dropped it off the local synagogue. I was like, say what? Hold on, Ron, hold that thought, just for a sec. Hey, honey. Hey, uh, it's your me, it's wife. It's Leslie, uh, nope. I have very big news for you. Oh, well, my teeth are blue. Blueberries what? are alcohol. Are you having a stroke? I just saying around that my dog's Jewish. Oh, phone water. Ben? Hello? Oh, hello? Hi, Leslie? It's dead. Hello? <sighs> you know, Leslie sounded weird. I don't want to wait for Tom. I want to walk home. I'll join you. I'm always game for a brisk walk. Also, if I leave you alone, I'm pretty sure you'll die. Home is that way. Watch out for that fence. Watch out for those riding lawnmowers, man. Dave, <laughs> <laughs> you are killing it. I am, right? Yes. See, just thinking I'm a congressman makes me feel like one. Yeah. Oh, also, I have a little secret. I'm drunk. I am too. Ever since we had our kids, it only takes like one sip of wine. I feel so good and condiffent. Mm -hmm. Con, I feel condiffent. You know what you should do? You should give a toast. Because if you were running for Congress, you have to give speeches, right? You want me to make a toast? I'll toast it up. Toast it, baby. Roast it and toast it. Tills brown on both sides. You know what? I had my time. You know, I did my thing. I wanted to be city councilor, and I did, and I was. And I, I was like, whoa! And people were like, but at least we have each other. I love you so much. I love you, too. This is real. I know. You're my husband. You're my wife. You married me in front of people. I did. I was there. We may have peaked, but it doesn't matter. We need to do something big, you know? Something that really lets people know that we're going to love each other forever. Yeah. What is it? I got it. Hello, sir. We're sober. We would like to get tattoos in our bodies because we love each other. Tattoos? This is a pawn shop. But yeah, sure, I can do that. Yes! <laughs> it's <gonna> <laughs> Look what he's doing, he's breaking pens. This is the idea of the century. Right here. Ow! Come here. Oh man, this wine bottle is all out of the wine. Well, hello, gentlemen. What brings you out on this fine evening? Mother Whoa, where'd you come from? Oh, that's a complicated question. All depends on whether your conception of time is linear or circular. What? Hello, Ron. Ron, you know this hobo? He was my counterpart from the Eagleton Parks Department. Dude, are you a ghost? Am I? What is happening right now? Baba boy. Hey, everybody, I'm Ben Wyatt. Listen, we, of course, are here to celebrate Donna and Joe. And I have to say, you know, getting married is the bravest, most wonderful thing you can do. Because every day you come home and you're just like, what? It's you. I love you. You're my sexy roommate. We love each other. Woo! You know? He's talking about me. Yes, I am, baby doll. Look, Donna and Joe are great. You all are great. And this wedding is gonna be amazing. Let's get some music and dancing going. And I am Ben Wyatt, and I very much approve this message! You want me to shut that down? No, I like it. Let the little man dance. Hey! question are we the cutest couple you've ever seen nope okay you want the long needle or the short needle doesn't matter can't find a short needle long needle it is i have a big idea i want a portrait of eleanor roosevelt tastefully done and then she has a very classy tattoo of pat benatar on her arm and that's very subtle no. No, scratch that. Scratch all that. Just right, Ben. Do you have anything to numb the pain? Sure. Take a scoop out of the peel bucket. Okay, you said you wanted Mouth Queen? 
No, stop, stop it. Stop everything that you're doing. Stop it. Anne's here. Anne wants a tattoo. Anne. No, no, no. Anne does not want a tattoo. No one wants a tattoo. Anne, relax. Be respectable for a second. Okay, what we're doing is not nuts. We are merely getting tattoos so that everybody knows we love each other and that we haven't peaked. It makes a lot of sense. Okay, we're leaving, all right? So say goodbye to the nice man and thank me for saving you from being on Dateline. Okay, let's go. Come goodbye, on. world travel. Later, bro, Heisen. Ben. Come on. Is this everybody? Anne took a cab. Tom's in the trunk, Jerry's on the roof. All right, where to first? Your mother's butt. <laughs> I'm so alone. If even one of you thinks about dry heaving in my car, you're all walking home. Mr. Ron Dunn, I have something I'm very angry about, but other Ron, he's not helping me with it. Can you help? Well, I can tell by the indigo on your chicklets that you've been drinking blueberry wine. That's a good start. A Wamapo called it Matapiqua. They believed it had mystical powers. Yeah, it also tastes like jelly. So what's got your goat there, friend? My parents, they had this lake house, and they sold it without telling me. And so I was like, why, you know? I was like, God, you guys! Oh, you're hanging on to that anger for dear life, compadre. Let's role play. Ben, what is the first rule of the Leslie Nope Emotional Support Task Force? Don't let her get a tattoo. What the hell happened? I couldn't help it. She's so cute when she's coming up with destructive <laughs> ideas. Never send a husband to do a best friend's job. Out, Wyatt. Walk it off. Walk it off. Fine. You did it. Yep. See you later, Anne. No, okay. nope, sit down. Mm. That was beautiful. You're surrendering to the Earth Mother. Now stare into the fire and picture your spirit animal. Well, I don't know what my spirit animal is. Because it doesn't exist, because that's nonsense, because you're an adult. Baby Snow Owl. He's right. Our spirit animals connect us to the natural world. You need to remain open to their message. Watch. Welcome back, old friend. If you really want to cleanse yourself of that anger, take that check and send it into the flames and up into the air with your screams. Do not burn that check. It is money. No, Ron's right, Ron. There, there, baby Snow Owl. You're safe now. I feel great I ran 5K this morning. Really? No, I threw up in the shower.